Hey there and welcome. If you've ever wanted to showcase your interactive Figma prototypes on Behance, but were stuck trying to figure out how to add a demo video to your case study, you're in the right place. By the end of this walkthrough, you'll know exactly how to record embed and present your Figma prototype as a slick, playable video directly on your Behance project. This is a fantastic way to bring your UI and UX work to life for potential collaborators, clients, and fellow designers. So let's dive right in and make your case study stand out. To start, I have a video I recorded using a tool called GIFCap, which lets you easily screen record your Figma prototype in action. Maybe you have your own favorite recorder. The main point is you want a video file that shows someone interacting with your design. This quick demo is what viewers on Behance will actually see and use to get a sense of your work in motion. Now, let's actually bring this video back into Figma. Go ahead and drag your recorded video file onto your Figma canvas. Dropping it onto your working file gives you more control and keeps your workflow organized, especially if you want to tweak anything within Figma itself. Make sure you size and position it just how you want it to appear. If you're new to importing videos into Figma, don't worry Figma supports most standard formats, and dragging and dropping is often the fastest way to go. Once your video's in place, it's time to present your prototype. That means switching to presentation mode so you can see your design as viewers would, complete with all the animations or video playback you've set up. This step not only gives you a preview of the final experience, but also unlocks the ability to share your interactive prototype moving forward. If something doesn't look quite right in presentation, take a quick pause and adjust it until you're happy. Next up, we want to share this experience outside of Figma, specifically on Behance. With your prototype in presentation mode, look for the option to share prototype. What Figma does here is generate a special embed code. This is a little snippet of HTML that essentially acts as a window, letting viewers access your prototype video right from another platform, in this case, Behance. Copy that embed code and let's head over to Behance. This part is exciting because you're about to integrate your interactive work into a case study that the world can appreciate. Once you're on Behance, go to share your work and select create project. You'll be guided through steps to build your project, give it a catchy title, add any supporting images or text, and so on. When you're ready to embed your video demo, click on Prototype. Behance offers a dedicated spot just for interactive prototypes, making this process a breeze. Now simply paste the embed code you copied from Figma into the provided field. If all went well, you'll see your prototype video pop up and start playing right on your Behance page. Give it a test run to make sure it looks and works as you expect. Don't worry if it takes a moment to load, especially for longer videos. This powerful feature means potential employers, clients, or fans can interact with and watch your demo without ever leaving Behance. And there you have it, your Figma prototype video is now live on your Behance case study. With this professional touch, your work speaks for itself. If you found this tutorial helpful, please hit that like button and let me know in the comments if you have any questions or want tips on recording awesome demo videos. Don't forget to subscribe for more practical tutorials that help you stand out as a designer. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.